Okay, long scarves. Um, I brought a selection actually because the different weights, you can see this one is long but quite thin, very, very thin in fact, whereas this one is long and it's actually quite a bit wider. You can see that, see? It's quite a bit wider. I'm going to work with the thin one, but don't uh, give up on the, on the wider ones. They're very popular at the moment. You see them all over the place, and you see them dressing up or dressing down an outfit. I've seen them with jeans and denim jackets and white t-shirts. Again, it's about what you feel comfortable with and what proportions work for you. Um, because I think what happens is we look in the magazine and we say, oh, I want to be that, I want mm -hmm. to do that. Make it your own. So take it, take what you like from fashion, take what you like from what's out there, but then twist it, make it your own, because diff all of us are different, and that's what makes it interesting. Mm -hmm. And look at other people on the street and say, wow, I, I, I like the way that's done. And as you can tell, I sort of like scarves. <laughs> um, it wasn't difficult for me to bring scarves in today. There's, there's that kind of a look, which is sort of casual, simple. Um, again, it's showing off what a pretty neck she has because she's a little tiny neck through here. Uh, and then it's bringing the eye down to her cleavage. Everything about clothing and accessories is about illusion and also about accentuating what you want to show off. So making the eye go to what you're feeling good about that day. Mm -hmm. And that can change from day to day. One day you can say, gosh, my eyes look great. I've spent a little more time on my makeup. I'm also going to wear a fabulous bright scarf here or something for you with those lovely green eyes. Mm -hmm. Let's put something on that pops the green eyes or maybe mm -hmm. some earrings that are a little bit bigger. Or it could just be a casual, oh, I want this to look relaxed and like I just threw it on and I'm being sort of casually elegant. Mm -hmm. That's pretty. one pretty way of doing it. Um, this is the other thing that you're seeing a lot at the moment is that sort of that kind of feel um, by doing it this way what you've done is you've anchored it at a point that you want it to mm -hmm. stay at because you've looped it around twice and then the weight of this will hold it in place um, but you may just decide as long as you're not here's the door duncan and you're not going to get caught under a bus <laughs> you may just it's very cute just hanging or wrapped over one way like that. That can be pretty too. So just have fun with them. And spend a little time in front of the mirror looking at it and also looking at it with the outfit you've got on. You may find that a shorter jacket, depending on your proportions again, to wrap a scarf around and wear it with a shorter jacket may feel right. Mm -hmm. Or you may want to wear it long because you're wearing a long coat and you're in Chicago or somewhere that's yeah. sort of, you know, more urban and or mm -hmm. Toronto where you're from, mm. where it's a little longer and a little easier. Exactly. Now this one is a bit more bundly, so you might want to do something fun like that with it, which is sort of a girl version of an old-fashioned man's ascot. See, that's kind of cool. And even from the side view, if you turn sideways, either way for mm -hmm. us, Erica, you can see, again, it's got a little bit of fullness to it. It's got a little fluff. Don't worry about making it too flat. I think the secret to scarves, especially when you look at people um, wearing them well, is there's a slightly relaxed, this is an accessory, I've had fun with it, and I've just sort of thrown it on. It's mm -hmm. not too perfect is another fun way to do it. Okay.